There are several companies that are making the porous polyethylene implant. This is the Supor implant here, the rim and the base, and this is the Medpor implant here, uh, the same components, and you can see they look very, very similar. Uh, this top piece is a little longer than the one on the Medpor, but that's not very significant. And on the other side, uh, this, they're very, very similar in appearance, just some minor differences. In addition, the, what you might notice though is the Supor rim is very flexible. You can twist it completely and it can hold a shape and be manipulated so that I can create and sculpt essentially this rim. The Medpor implant, although can twist, is restricted and if I twist more it might fracture and its ability to squish this way I'm hitting big resistance when I do this whereas this you can completely twist it and it just bounces right. Hi I'm Jeff, Dr. Lewin's son. I love baseball so today she wants me to show you how strong the support ear implant is. Here. Where is it? Oh, that's okay. I see it. All right. There it goes. Let's look at the damage. And it looks like it is completely intact. No damage at all.